We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. It's all melded now. Do our damnedest. I don't remember them very well. Who are they? All right. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? It's not much, but here, for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Hey, Lee. All right. Really gave that old man hell. Yeah, we did. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Uh, I was stuck to it. He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Yep, kid. How's she doing? She's good, I think. <laughs> She's what a kind tough of option right is that? There. How should I She's know? Just that's a, a jerk thing to say. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Yeah, it's true. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. Yep. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? Uh, oh, they own this place. They uh, own this place. Oh, they God. Pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're gone. Oh, oh no. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Hmm. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? I tried to save him. You ran away. It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice and kill John. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. That's true. I guess. That's true. <laughs> Try to so. let it go. Alright, let's go. Into the officina. Wait, I didn't give him the bar? Who didn't I give a... Uh, I guess I didn't give it to... She needs it. Yes. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Took care of Clementine. All right, let's go. Ah. Uh. Can't think about them in here. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. This door leads to the back alley. Alright. That could be an escape route. Or something. Maybe. The first aid kit. Obviously. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. So I guess there's no point in looking at the things. I might as well just take him. Ah, uh, that's a picture of his family. Their son was the pharmacist. Why do Find you... anything? 
Why do you do that? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. It might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. <laughs> You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Oh. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid God. attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? The world is ending out there. Who cares who I am? If you don't think people will find any reason to turn on you, especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Whatever. Oh, no. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this okay. lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, it's time to then go. we have a problem. We have to hurry up. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I guess it's good to get on people's good side. My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or protect her, at least. Yeah. that what's that a weapon this was my dad's cane he'd zip around here on it from time to time was he sick <laughs> no nah, he was okay i actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could <laughs> plus he knew how to make it look cool like you and your hat my dad gave it to me See, dads are smart like that. I guess these characters are kind of similar because they both lost their parents now. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Oh no, there's definitely something Here right behind go. that door. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <sighs> How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But yep. I think it'll be okay. Okay, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> oh my god, this is a terrible story. It's so sad. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? <sighs> what do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Smarty. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, like that. Yep. You didn't answer my question. All right, a little further. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Uh, Do they, like, hate you? Because they're dead. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't know. I'm just sorry for being mean. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things Oh my god, this is such a sad story. Yeah. <laughs> Can't believe this. Um... I got into some trouble and, and I didn't talk to him for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. I'm surprised other people didn't try and come into this office before when they took the bodies out to move this stuff to get into this. Ow! Oh my god. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Um. Nothing. 
gets the remote to my dad's TV. That's what I figured. Nothing. Ain't nothing on. Come on, there's gotta be something in here. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Yep. Let's have a look at that finger. Ah, oh, this oh. story is so It sad. hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Let's go. Yes, please. Put that band-aid on. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Where can the key be? Hmm. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Maybe Lee? we can find it in here. Yeah? You're not bad, right? I... Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was ah. one of the things trying to eat you? It's complicated. Sometimes things happen there. You do things and you can't explain them. Let's uh, head back to the others. At least one of those things didn't pop up and said, oh, she remembered you saying that or something like that. Yes. So hey. you're going to die. I'm gonna get back to him now. Where is the key? I guess you have to take a look outside with that guy now. This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, hmm. well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. Oh, we'll no. will talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? Awesome. It's about I'll to go down. down. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Where is the, uh, the key? Maybe the key's outside? How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yes, I do. Let's have a look around. Okay. <laughs> this guy. Jesus. What? What was the point of this? I thought there would be a key out here or something. Disgusting. He just eat. As far as I can tell, he's all the care of And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. <laughs> How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. All right.
That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? <laughs> I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. That's his brother. Yeah, I agree. Just That's his brother. brother. That's so that. sad. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. A hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Get him out. No. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I'll just hope the power is still on. Come out. You can just do that? <laughs> well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AB. Let's try. There we go. Well, fucking done, Doug. <laughs> the cursing curse might be life. a little unnecessary. Who's to say it already hasn't? <laughs> Guy's got no. He's got no joke. Them to take notice. All right, we can still do the other one. Open sesame. That won't work. <laughs> I was kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doug. <laughs> did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. Hmm. What happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around. Oh, there. God. All right. So. Okay. Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? Nope. No. <laughs> Did anyone ever have it? There were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... Can't really do much here. Uh... Those things like TV. Or at least the sound of it. If they were louder, we might be able to clear the street. Let's go back inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. Maybe if I get the cane. Who knows? Who knows what I gotta do around now? Maybe if I come back in here. <laughs> I feel like I need this cane. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Yeah, we could. Hold on a second, guys. Let me check something real quick. <laughs>